How's it going everybody? This is the guy who's the sugar loafer man. I have went to a garage sale today to pick up my lot for the first lot of September. And I got some great finds. Found this blender here, so Futura 2 in very good condition with the blender a plastic, uh, it's not the glass one, but it got the plastic picture with the lid and everything else. I found it for $3. And like I done, I went online and I looked it up. And it's worth $18. And that's the low price. $18 to $29. I like to go with the low price and just add the shipping on. I found some other great finds. See, this is the future. Let me show you here. This is a nice piece. Three bucks. Can't beat it. Vintage. I love vintage. I love it. What I'm doing here, I'm sitting in my garage and just going through my lot. And um, I found this apple here. 50 cents. Vintage Fisher Price. Can't go wrong with these apples here. If you find them and that bell still ringing, buy it. $20 apple. Can't go wrong with it. Yeah, like I said, I'm just sitting here going through my lot. And uh, decided to put something online for you guys. To show you, the raw sales is, 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 is where it's at. Look at the price tag on that there. If you could see it, I paid 25 cents. I just looked this item here up, and this is a picture of McDonald's. Uh, I believe this right here is from 2005. Paid 25 cents for it at the yard sale. Brand new and original packaging. Usually I like to keep these for when my kids get older. They'd be worth a lot of bit money. Um, but I think I'm going to put it online. I seen it could sell for twelve dollars. I'm gonna act, I'm gonna go for ten dollars. Can't beat it. Another great item I found. We fit with the game and everything. See, and the original packaging, original owner, older lady, hardly never played. I'm gonna put that online there. I got a package deal and everything. I spent forty five dollars at her house. And uh, but I got a package deal. I got the controllers and all the rest of this stuff. With her lot of me paying forty five dollars, I'm gonna make a hundred dollars off of that. So easy doubling your money, you know. And um, what else did I buy here? Let's see. I went to another yard sale and I found Hot Wheels. This right here. Triples what I paid for the lot. I paid a 25 cents a piece. This car here is worth twenty dollars. I think I got ten of them. That's two fifty. I'm gonna almost ten times my money. Hot Wheels can't beat a brand new in the wrapper. I'm telling you, for the garage sales. Garage sales is where it's at. I bought a uh, a stereo, a car stereo. And that car stereo I paid ten dollars for. I just looked it up. It's great condition. Speakers never used with it. It's worth seventy five dollars. Only paid ten dollars for it. Garage sales is where it's at. Now usually when I go to the garage sales, I have an Apple iPhone with me to, to do my research and everything. But when I I didn't have an Apple today, so what I done was stepped in with faith and I said, you know what? Come on. I've been doing it for so long, I know where to sell and what will not sell. Like, check these Tupperware cups out. Let me show them to you. These are Tupperware mugs, vintage. I got all type of colors here. I think I got eight to ten of cups. I only paid a dollar for all of them. I'm going to sell all of these as a lot for $20. Can you beat it? No, you can't. Great. And me selling it for twenty dollars, I'm still giving the customer a great deal because other people is asking from fifty nine dollars down to about thirty dollars for only four. I'm giving them eight. God is good. Now what else did I pick up? I picked this uh clock up here. I love clocks for some reason. I just can't get enough of them. See this clock? Let's take a look at it. Very nice Westlock clock, made from China. It's not vintage as I like, but it's a good piece. It's a good item, and I only paid, if you could see it, I only paid 50 cents for it. Now, it works. Tick, 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 tick. Five dollars. I'm good to go. 
Ventures Curling Irons. Can you beat it? 75 cents. Very good condition. Not broken. Clean it up. Put it on eBay. They go from 10 to 19.99. I'm gonna ask eight dollars, 75 cents. Can you beat it? Nope, you can't beat it. Now, what else did I buy? I bought a light bright. Light brights are the truth. But the light bright I bought is complete and everything, but it's from 19.99. Well, usually when I buy light brights, I prefer my light brights to be early, you know, I mean from the 70s, 60s, you know, uh, 80s, I don't think they made them in the 60s, but you know what I'm saying, I like the bitches items, 19.99, hey, I think I paid $2 for it, it's worth $20, can you beat it, no, so guys, I'm just telling you about what I've done, and you know, I told you I spent today was $70 at the garage sale, and as I went through calculating and labeling my items I'm up to about three hundred and fifty dollars after reselling them so seventy three fifty can you beat it I guess you get the point no you can't beat it it's good to go ain't it so what I'm gonna do right now I'm gonna prepare my item for resale I'm gonna clean them go through them and get them right for so I can list them and put them out there for the market Put them at a great rate and put them out there for the, everybody can see them and they can click that beautiful buy it now. Buy it now, baby. Take care. God bless.